Yo, what's up, yo? Lakers we watching after that. the Lakers. Play by and LeBron Philly James. Play. LeBron, 20 points. LeBron seven with 20 in his 10 return. 7. 10 reads. So he's got the double double. 20 and yeah. 10. Wow. Like seven is, assists. Like LeBron, he just walks out on the court. He's going to get numbers ago. for you. Looks like he's going to lead the Lakers maybe to a victory. Yeah, That's the LeBron play. Yeah. He plays the whole game. And then he plays again in the last six minutes. He's going to win. 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 He's Every damn year, he plays to get to the end. That's what you got to do. The fourth quarter, the end of the season. That's what he's saying. That's what counts. And the fact that he has played so hard for so long and still be able to do the things that he's done. I have so much credit for LeBron. He the man. He hold it down every which way. He's just got to rack something. Like Kobe. A Shaq. You're in L.A. now. I want to hear you fix. They're talking to him. He's not coming out. That'd be cool. Yeah, if not, yo. What it do? I think he can do it. I'm not going to say it, but he flew it. He attacked Boban, and when he came over to behind the back, and then, you feel it. You know, he doesn't really jump. Boban really doesn't jump. Yo, he stays flat when he's you so feel it? big. He gets a hand on the peg. Get every the shot out of it. After the fake. He must have called that on Tobias. Like a pretty good play. People do their age. That's what we're feeling. He gave it all for this sport. He would do anything to win in his power. He did it all. He is the guy you want out of anyone in the league. It's LeBron. Even at his age, he is still number one. And because of that, he should pick first to give up the two in a row to Giannis. In the draft on the All Star game, because that's what they're doing now. Actually, players are going to draft their teams. Well, a lot of it's because during the course of the first three, he's more of a, a facilitator, Just to make it getting the ball to other people. But then when the fourth quarter comes, he realizes that I need to get some baskets. And I like he's it. really good at getting some baskets. He misses, and Marjanovic has it again. Unbelievable. The big guy. I mean, if you don't put a big body on him, you know what? They deserve something, man. This guy likes this guy over this guy. He's gonna pick him. He is the best. He can do that. So give it up. He's not worried. L.A. v. L.A. Clippers, Lakers. Get baskets and get to the line. They double up. That's good defense. But still need to shoot. Tobias Harris directing traffic. Lance is on him. Harris, tough shot. Rebound. What a rebound. Holy jeez. Rondo's got a double-double. L.A. really played well against L.A. Lakers got a nice rebound. But LeBron taking it. In, dish it out. Rondo. Comes up short. He's coming off being hurt. Now you don't give up a three. Make him work for a goose. Here's the three. With a tie. Clippers tied it up with 35 points. We left. This is what we live in, folks. Entertainment like this. It doesn't get better than this. You got LeBron. As the ninth seed, going to go up against the eighth seed. And this is a good win to take. Because LeBron's as good as you want to be. I'm telling you. He wants that eighth seed. 
this year round. Again, the importance of this game in the standings. Seventh, sixth, fifth, fourth, the fourth that's the second, third, spot fourth. In the West. So Lakers do it all. Tied with Sacramento coming into tonight. Two full games. So back. what they've been slumping. They don't give a shit. When it comes to playoffs, LeBron plays at another level. He takes that. Support. Magic Johnson and AC. He's always there. He's Nine played more minutes one. in Clipper the playoffs than probably any. Nine-one. Well, this possession for he the Lakers plays is the, uh, playoffs. the ball game. They have got to scratch to the final on this every possession. Year. Lakers it's LeBron versus the rest of the league. LeBron Tyson and LeBron Brandon is getting tired of it because he has done all that he can to achieve. He is a great freaking player. If it was Kobe or even MJ, no one mans up to LeBron. LeBron's physical capability. He was gifted a bit with height, but he ate that food and made himself built. He is huge. He worked out like he is just a monster. Today's players have seen more than what the past has in. And they take it all in, and we will only get better at what we need to be. Because that's what we are. Progressing through life. But when is it enough? You know the Lakers had a to give it up to Mother Earth and just say, you know what? Some of us aren't progressing. Like the winding down and, the Clippers got the rebound. and it's late and now I'm watching a game. And I totally to forgot. It was one o'clock in the morning. Attempt at it, but they've got to make sure their defense puts them in a position to win so with another attempt, not be in a position where they have to score to force OT. That's disturbing the peaks. You know Lou Williams is going to be the trigger man. So what I'm going to do is give you the piece. Because people the are living deceit to therapy. And, the and it's disturbing me. And that's what keeps me up at night. And maybe the L.A. versus L.A. And the Lakers just NBA basketball game. You know what I mean. That's what we do on the scene. LeBron playing hard. So he's D.I.E. This man is the game. He is the game. When you see NBA, you think LeBron. Right now, who are you thinking? LeBron. Who do you want? LeBron. He ain't scared yet. Go sit at that 19. He ain't even scared. He building chemistry. That's what you need. You need one year. And the fact that he can take LA from what they were to what they are. They have improved. Because they weren't that good before. But yo. I know. I know LeBron did more, did more for this game than Michael Jordan. When it comes down to doing all that you can to be better, even if it means being a little taller, something you can't control. LeBron is taller, he is more dominant than Michael Jordan. And he is at a small forward position. And when you think dominance, you think chef. Okay. LeBron is like, okay, if Dwight Howard is mini Shaq, LeBron is like Dwight Howard's son. Because he's like the 6'8 the or 6'9 of Dwight Howard. He's just like, he's Dwight Howard that moves faster, shoots better. I'm sorry, Dwight Howard. is a great player. He gets more rebounds because he has those two inches. And he's got a good vertical. And he will dunk on you. And he plays that inside really well. But now LeBron... LeBron has ten and a half seconds to go with the game time. 
Call in the timeout. This is what it comes down to. If you ain't feeling this, I don't know what you want. It's Friday, 1 o'clock in the morning. The actual Friday. You know what I mean. We go hard on Thursday night to sleep all of Friday. Because Friday is when you get paid. And you need a second to think about what you do. And just say to yourself, look, it was Friday. And I just got paid. But I'm already hung over. And you say, okay, I've got money now, but I ain't going to fuck it up. You know what I mean? You give yourself that response. It's like, okay, I bought hard before I had the money. Because now that I have the money, I want to be sick. I don't want to do itch. That's what it be. Just live life in peace. Probably put the ball in the hands of LeBron for the I will be sick all my life if it means I am taken care of and I'm at peace. I don't want to be in the hospital, no jail. I want to live as long as my mom is alive, for sure. I'm just shouting that out because I love my mom. But then after that, it would be hard. And that's when I really need to go. I haven't been saying much to the females. You know what the deal's been, man? When you got everything you want, they want a piece, man. Three seconds left. LeBron just missed. He drove to the net. But now he's got to play defense. There's the strip, and there it goes. I mean, the momentum of the basketball, when it rocketed out of bounds... That's why it looked like it went yeah. off of LeBron, but right there. The way it goes off from that angle, it does look like it's off his knee. But then you look at it. I know, this is a call that like you it. see a lot. Oh, there you see it go off, off his right hand. hand. It did go off did of LeBron's if it hand. Does, if it didn't touch Beverly, the guy who strips the ball it, always then, gets I mean, called yeah, for LeBron being the That's guy who hits it right out of bounds Not when really the guy who's holling the ball right actually has less contact on the ball. Because when they're swiping it, it's like they swipe the ball, but they just hit the ball and then... The swipe motion is faster than the motion of the ball being held by the person on offense and the fact that the ball releases from the guy on offense's hands after the fact that the swipe has been made, but the last possession is actually in the offender's hands. But then the thing is, you got people who can't drive now because all they have to do is just whack the ball, come in front of you and whack the ball. Defense. They are going to or try come to from the side, you know they're guarding you, and then turn and whack the ball. And they don't like that, because they can call a reach-in on that, or even a shooting foul if he's trying to go up. They'll give it to him. Because you don't want to give defense too much pleasure. You want offense to score, and that's what NBA has been doing. It's been more scoring, more better players. Probably going to his left. Refs take it easier. They want to see good games like this. 112 a piece with three seconds left. I'm surprised they don't have Lou take it out so that he can throw it in and get it right back. He's going to get it right now. He gets it easily. Oh, they actually gave it to Philly. Overtime. We are going an extra five tonight at Staples Center. Did I just wow. jinx that call? Because you know what? LeBron's right. He would is not the only one who gets that call. When people strip the ball, it always goes to the offense. When the defense made the play. But it would result in so much less scoring 
at 112. That they let it go, and they'd rather see the offense take the ball. Or even give him a foul, because he touched his hand a little bit. It's like, how am I supposed to hit all ball when he's moving the ball all around? You know how hard it is to steal a ball from someone with basic ability to dribble? You have to be thinking about his next steps. It's like, okay, if the pick's coming from here, he's going to roll here. And as he's running at me, I'm going to swipe for the ball because he's just thinking, I got to wait this second till the pick comes. And that's when I make my play because he's just kind of drifting into the screen. You know what I mean? But... You gotta pass the ball, man. It's a team sport. No matter what you say, you gotta give it up for the whole team. It's a team sport. The only sport I really did where, like, my parents paid for it was jiu-jitsu. And I am so thankful they chose that. Even though I didn't get the full experience, it's probably better for me. Because the dojo I was at, they played for points. It's like, okay, we'll teach you how to do everything, but we're not going to be whipping each other into the ground. It's like, just guide them to the ground. You know the movement. Is this not traveling, William? And I could never take that to the next level. I was the king of scoring points. But when we played real tournaments, I got my ass beat. I had this man running at me and I wasn't prepared for it. But that was then. Now I give a shit. I'll take all that shit. You come at me, blindside, and you knock me in the head. If I have an ounce of life left in me, I am coming back at your ass and ripping it off. I am ripping your head off. If you touch me. I don't like to be touched. With no needles, with no medication, I ain't with that. If I want therapy, I know what I want and what I need. Thank you very much. What it do, what it be. Let the drill for double dose be at peace. So we dip a little of this into the peace. So, so what we need be is to dip a little more into all being in peace. Because for all of us not being in peace, the dip to the stove as we live outdoors. Some don't get to live in a world of their own. We must give them permission to live among us. That's what we do to our own kind. We don't even give a shit about people across the world who don't have anything. Are you kidding me? And there's billionaires and there's trillionaires in the world. But they don't want you to know that. There's one person who owns all the banks. He owns money. Any money that gets made, he owns it. And there's another guy who does something else with the money. He makes the money legal or something. I don't fucking know. He, there's like two guys who have all the money. And I forgive them both. Because they were given what they are given before them. But it's up to man himself to tell that man there are people not living and we are concerned because as far as I'm living... This greatest life that I've been given, I want to give it to someone else. And I know when we all come together, the peace among us will be better than any wealth, any greed, 
Anything we need, we will already have, and that is it. Thank you, L.I.P.